based on the slope of a line we have a very interesting question here related to the uh, population of a city consider the following population and the year graph given below find the slope of the line a b and using it find what will be the population in the year 2020 so see the question is trying to make us a demographer for instant people becomes actor to to play the roles of different different characters now this mathematics is going to make us uh, for instant a demographer uh, well let's see uh, the question is saying actually see here uh, this is the population you know this is population uh, population and here M stand for the million and this is the year all right and year 2000 the population was 12 million and in year 2010 the population was 16 million and now we need to predict what will be the population in the year 2020 okay what will be the population let me see the population will be uh, let's say M M will be the population all right uh, at that time M means uh, I don't know how many million cities all right we need to find out that so how to find it I, I said already that it is based on the slope of a line and the first we need to find out the slope of the AB also the question is saying first find the AB the slope of the AB all right so first let's find the slope of the AB and then I'll tell you how to find this you know uh, like uh, uh, this is uh, this is a line right this is a line in which uh, the AB has the inclination uh, let's if you make this if you extend this uh, the inclination let's say this is theta right so the AB line has the inclination AB same inclination will be with BC line and the same inclination will be uh, if this is C point all right and uh, the same inclination will be with AC line it means I'm going to say since the inclination since the angle all this line segment AB line segment AC line segment BC everything has every every line segment has the same angle of inclination it means every line segment will have the same slope means the slope of the AB will be the slope of the BC and will be the slope of the AC by equating those things we can easily find out the population in the year 2020 all right so first as the question is saying let's find the slope of AB so slope of AB here will be slope of AB will be simple difference of y coordinate uh, y2 minus y1 over difference of x coordinate all right so here our uh, y coordinate is how much uh, let me suppose this is um, uh, x2 y2 i'm imagining this as x2 y2 and this as a x1 y1 so that time uh, y2 minus y1 that is 16 16 minus 12 all right 16 minus 12 over uh, 2010 minus 2000 2010 minus 2000 all right so it's going to be 16 minus 12 that's 4 and 2000, uh, uh, 2010 minus 2000 that's 10 so 2 times 2 2 times 5 so our slope of AB uh, is going to be 2 over 5 all right that's the slope of the AB now we need to find out the population in the year 2020 what is the value of M all right so what I'm, I'm going to do I'm going to write the slope of uh, suppose BC so what is the slope of BC all right let's write here uh, in the side uh, slope of BC slope of BC will be again y2 minus y1 that is m minus 16 all right y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1 all right 2020 minus 2010 all right so it's going to be m minus 16 over 10 but do you know one thing the slope of this BC and the slope of this AB both are equal so I can equate this 2.2 uh, 2 over 5 and this one so since uh, since slope of uh, AB is equal with slope of BC so it will be slope of AB is 2 by 5 and slope of BC is M minus 16 over 10 so let's solve it and very simple you know 5 times 2 and this 2 will multiply this 2 so we'll get 4 and m minus 16 and this uh, 4 plus 16 will be m so therefore the value of the m is going to be now 20 it means the population of that city in year 2020 in 2020 will be uh, 20 million all right this is how we need to find out and this is the work of a demographer if you want to be in future demographer this kinds of lot of problem you need to do so see to be a demographer also you need to learn mathematics this is called the beauty of mathematics